So to wind up and send your Lego rubber band car, take the rubber band around the two black pins in the front, find the black pin in the back to connect it. You're going to need to hold onto the wheel. If you, if you don't hold onto the wheel, it's going to snap that rubber band off. So take that rubber band, loop it around the front, loop it around the rear axle, and then you can wind it up several ways. You can twist with your hand, making sure to always keep uh, a finger on the wheel so it doesn't unwind. You can spin the entire car around the axle, one way to do it. And then the last way, and maybe the easiest way to keep track of how many rotations, is to take the car and then push it backwards and you'll notice that it's winding up and then let go. And so one more time, secure the rubber band to the front of the car, attach it to the back of the car, and then whatever method you're gonna use to wind up, just keep that method consistent throughout the duration of your rubber band car. So if I'm gonna go here and then I'm going to pull it back to wind it up, you can see that it's winding up, let go. And off goes the rubber band car. All right, I hope that helps those that needed a little help with how to attach the rubber band to the rear axle.